Hey everyone, I noticed something interesting with um, version uh, 0.126 of 7.1 firmware that just came in uh, today. So as you can see, it says key is not inside, unable to start car. I'm going to load up remote S and I'm going to ask the car to summon in reverse. Now watch what happens. I did not do a keyless start. Um, it is noting right now up here, key is no longer inside, car will not restart. But without doing a keyless start, um, Summon is actually uh, opening up the garage, as you can see, and it's actually moving the vehicle. Uh, it seems, by the way, that the Summon is a little bit more aggressive. It seems like it's, it's coming out uh, faster than it did previously. Um, that just might be my perception, but um, it does feel that way. So again, I used Remote S to summon in reverse without a keyless start initiated, and the vehicle is actually moving. You'll see that it's actually going to complete. Summon is going to stop right here. The garage door is going to shut. Now here's the other interesting part. I have not done a keyless start. I'm in park. I now hit the brake and go into reverse. It's actually allowing me to drive the car. I have not start the car started the car. All I have done, put my seatbelt on because I didn't expect to be able to drive, I'm actually driving the car having only used the summon feature. Um, I have not, I'm going to go into reverse, I'm actually going to drive back into my uh, driveway, but basically it looks like, I don't know if this is a feature or unintentional, but um, the car is actually able to be driven after a summon, but without um, having to initiate a keyless start. So there you go.